Hey, how's it going guys? It's CK here and welcome back to Forza Horizon 2 for the second last car from the Fast and Furious DLC, which I'm going to be doing at least. It is Dom's Daytona from Fast and Furious 6. And I've got to say, this is probably the most sexiest car out of the bunch. It is absolutely gorgeous. I love this kind of like dark cherry red paint job. And how it's basically clean, there's no badging or anything on it, and that wing though, oh my god, it's the signature dish of the Daytona, as you all know, but ho oh, oh, we're just going to be taking a nice little drive in it today, guys, and also doing some races with it, because you all know the story of the Daytona, it was a very, very successful NASCAR, and yeah, you can't bear a Daytona without doing a race, so we're up nice and early in the morning of Horizon, just to go for a nice quick drive with this thing, this is probably my favourite time in the game because the sun's just coming up and it just starts to shine right off the car. It's sensational. But anyway, we've got quite a few things to talk about today, guys. And the starting, to start off, I just want to thank someone on Facebook for actually making, like, fan art. It, uh, I think the guy's name's Ewan, so big thanks to you, man. I'll put the picture on the screen right now. It is pretty funny. It's got Mr. Swagged at Raccoon. What are you doing, SLS? Yeah, karma's a bitch, mate. <laughs> He's crashed into that blooming barrier. But yeah, it's a picture of Mr. Swag the Raccoon and my channel logo and everything and my subscriber amount. It is unbelievable. Seriously, guys, we're nearly at 75,000 of you. That is unbelievable. And so is that site. Is God coming down or something? It bloody looks like it. The petrol head gods are, have been awoken. God damn, man. Literally. <laughs> But yeah, thanks a lot, Ewan. Really do appreciate it. If you do want to send some like RN guys uh, of Mr. Swag at Raccoon or even Drift, who is my persona, then uh, leave. I think you can leave it on my Twitter. Yeah, that's probably the best place to put it. Just leave it on my Twitter page with me tagged in it. So yeah, apart from that, speaking of leaving things, leave your questions down below, guys, for a QA. I'm going to be doing one later in the week or at the start of next week because a lot of you have been noticing have been wanting me to do another Q&A so leave it about anything you want leave a question about anything you want me to do uh, it can be about cars, gaming uh, me got anything at all anything at all man I'll answer them all I'll try my best to answer them all depends on how much we actually get but yeah Anyway, as I said, leave them in the comments below with a hashtag EKQ. That's how I know it's for the Q&A. And we're going off-road a little bit. God damn it. God damn it. So, I've not been at this airport in a video for a very, very long time, guys. So, we're going to try and get our mojo on. See how much drift points we can get. Now, in the Mitsubishi, we racked up over 50,000. So, we'll try and beat that around here. I don't know if it's going to be possible, but we'll give it a bash. We will... Give it a bash as long as we don't hit into anything. I think I'm going to do that. That was close. That was very, very close. We nearly hit, in, we nearly hit into a lamppost. God damn. Keep her going. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I wasn't concentrating there. I was not concentrating one bit now. Today, I actually woke up pretty late, guys. I mean, I never normally, like sleep to very very late in the afternoon but I woke up at 4 p.m. today yeah I was like what the fuck I went to bed around about 1 p.m. last night no not 1 p.m. 1 a.m. <laughs> that was a very 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 early bedtime um yeah 1 a.m. and I didn't wake up till about 4 p.m. you know when sleep catches up on you yeah you're definitely going to need that and I must have needed it seriously so let's see what we can through here it kind of likes to stick around the low gears for drifting, which is quite good. Because you get other cars that just go through their revs too quickly, and you don't really get a, like a smooth drift flow, if you know what I mean. Because it's always hitting off the rev limiter, and it's just going bear, 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 bear. You don't really get the power delivering to perform a smooth drift, if you know what I mean. So let's check out the interior. Oh my god, the strip to the bone. It's stripped to the bone. Oh god. I wonder if we're going to keep it going. Keep it going. Yes. I like this thing. It's well balanced for a big muscle car like this. 
don't get any sense of like body roll or anything, which I quite like. Because with most muscle cars, they're flopping about like a big hippo all over the place, but this one, since it has been tuned to perfection, it is fantastic on the handling front, especially for the drifting, if you can keep it going. Oh god, the rain! Not the rain, the Scottish weather has came into the game! God damn! Oh, oh the suspension! Don't hang in, mate. Is that Fiat? Hey, little Fiat! How are you doing? Is it it's like Babbler Bobby. Oh my god, I've just seen a Dodge. What are you doing? You're meant to be back in America. You're not meant to be in Italy. <laughs> so out of place. What are you doing? Have a pizza for free and then go back to the US. <laughs> but um, yeah, I don't know if you guys have seen Nero's new video. Holy shit. Holy shit. Their song is called Into the Night. But if you like like cool action anime and mixed with Tron, you'll definitely like this really, really well. And the song is fantastic as well. I love Nero. They've got to be one of my favourite. I don't really know what genre you could class Nero as. Some of the songs are kind of drum and bass, some of them are kind of dubstep -y, and some of them are kind of like EDM wise. So I call them kind of electronic or EDM. So let me know in the comments what would you class Nero as if you're listening to them, guys. But we're actually doing quite bad in terms of drift score. God damn. God damn. Is this thing. It has the power to do it. It's got seven, like 675 horsepower, 568 pounds feet of torque, and about 0 to 60 in 3.7 seconds, and a top speed of like 203. So it's got the power. It's got the power to do it. Yeah, I've had enough of the cockpit view. I like when I'm drifting. I like to see my cars. I mean, so much better. Oh, we can do a chicane around the planes. Chicane around the plane. That didn't go well, but we can. Hold it with a donut. Exit what would nearly be a crash with style. There we go. Oh no, 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 mate. No, Mr. 355. What are you doing breaking? What are you doing breaking? You've got the whole freaking airport, mate. Crying out loud, man. You had to choose to break at that precise moment and I'm trying to show my audience some of my drifting skill. <laughs> it's not much, but I've got some drifting skill. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I am loving this thing. Well, what is it like compared to the off road charger? It is, one, a lot more controllable, two, um, a lot more faster, I think, definitely, and three, it is overall goddamn sexy looking. Very, very nice. I mean, if you could do anything to this car, what would you do? I don't know what I would do. It's just sheer perfection on my front. I'd be kind of wondering what it would look like in black, but the red, ooh, ooh. Looks lovely. Absolutely lovely. But, um, yeah. Oh god. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh. <laughs> That's what you get when you don't know what you're going. That's what you get, man. Right, we'll head down to... We'll go to Nice? Have we been to Nice? Yeah, we've been to Nice in the last video, so we'll head up somewhere else. <laughs> or we could do this thing off-road. That would be pretty funny, but I ain't gonna do that. I'm gonna respect it for what it is. It is a Charger. Daytona. It is a legend. Oh my god, man. Let me know in the comments, guys. Do you want me to get Just Cause free? I know a lot of people have been asking me about that, but I'm like, it's a racing game channel. It doesn't really fit in, but I know there's cars and everything in it. But still, I like the game. I love Just Cause 2. It's one of my muck around games. We just blow shit up, but yeah, I'm not really too sure about Just Cause 3. I would get it if you guys would watch it. That's the thing. So, yes. What's the point of making videos if you guys don't watch it? That's the thing. Here we go. Oh my god. Oh yes. This has got the steering set up, which I like. You don't need to counter correct it or anything. Well, you do need to counter correct it at the end of a drift. But when you're going through the drift, you just keep on steering and steering and steering to the left. And it's perfectly fine. Just perfectly fine. It keeps it going. I love it. And brake. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Oh my god. Brake. Brake. It does surprisingly have quite good brakes for a big old muscle car like this. I know it's kind of... Really, Ford car? Really? Really? Thank you, mate. Thank you. But yeah, I'm pretty sure this thing has a resto mod. It, it must be, obviously. But it's a hell of a good one at that. It looks sick. It looks absolutely sick. Because if I had a muscle car or anything in real life, that is what I would do to it. Resto mod it. Get a 1970 Hemi Cuda but put all of the comforts from the modern day era into it, like air conditioning, big leather comfy seats, stereo, woman, iPod connectivity, 
everything, basically. That would be insane. Imagine that. God, I would love to do that. Especially with, like, a old Jag, like an Eagle Speedster or something. Ha! Oh. Oh, damn, 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 damn. So, we'll go for one last drift attempt, guys, and we'll end off the video. Wait, 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 wait. What is that in front of us? Wait, did we not say we we're going to do a race in this video? Yes, we did. So, I think... Oh, Jesus. Will we do it against the P1? Daytona versus McLaren P1. This probably won't go well, but we'll give it a bash. Let's see. <laughs> Ooh, sticky! What a name that is. <laughs> Ooh, sticky. 2.6 miles. Oh, ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Oh, yes, mate. You didn't think about that, did you? Goodbye, sucker! Yes! <laughs> oh, man. Just a little bit of ingenuity there, guys. <laughs> I just seen that opportunity and I took it. So the P1 is going to be wondering where the hell I went. Oh, my God. Where the hell did that American guy go? He went off road, some bitch. I don't know why the P1's turned into American. <laughs> so random today. So random. That's why I like it. That's why I like it. So we're finishing off. Where is that again? I can never know the difference between the San Giovanni area and the Montalino area. Where the fuck am I going? I know it's over there, but come on. Crying out loud. Abby. Crying for no reason. Can't remember how that KTB song goes, but fuck it. Go, go, go. Cut across the grass. Yes! Dun, 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 dun. Charger power. Sexy charger power. Oh, yes. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, good. Oh, my God. I forgot about that. Is that the bear? Is that the Baja bug? No, it was a Ford Ranger. Not a car again. God damn. What is it with little Ford cars in this episode? Rating of festival racers before you challenge them. Pay attention to the difficulty of festival racers before you challenge them. How about no hen? <laughs> How about, no, how about you just let me drive and I didn't realise I had that much money. Four million credits. Oh, oh my god. But anyway guys, if you have enjoyed this video, then a like would be much appreciated. Let me know what you make of Dom's Daytona. In the next episode, which is going to be the last one for the Fast and Furious car pack, we're going to be doing an utter legend and probably one of the best cars from the Fast and Furious series. So, for me... Horizon 2 and Dom's Charger. We'll see you in my next video, guys. Thanks for watching. Peace.